Hello friends, welcome back to Technique. In this video, we will be doing a quick speed comparison of two devices or rather two flagship devices. The Xiaomi 15 uh, with the Snapdragon 8 Elite platform and we also have the iQOO's uh, flagship for 2025, the iQOO 13. Now both of these devices have a lot of similarities including the Snapdragon 8 Elite platform, LPDDR5 x RAM, UFS 4.0, Android 15 out of the box and a lot of uh, things are similar even the camera system is a triple camera system it's a 50 megapixel triple camera system but we are not going into those aspects we are going uh, into the performance let's see how good the experience is in terms of opening of apps the memory management uh, the network speed the raw benchmark score all these things we will be comparing in this video so before going into the video if this is your first time on this channel do hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so let's begin so first let's open the about device on both the phones so there you go you can see here hyper os 2.0 with android 15 and uh, here we have 16 gigs of ram or rather 12 gigs of ram uh, here we have 16 gigs of ram so that's the variant so uh, this is fun touch os 15 and the snapdragon 8 elite platform and uh, we get android 15 on both the devices uh, hyper os 2.0 is the version on uh, this uh, device so quite similar hardware so let's uh, see how the experience is so let's just clear off all the background apps on both the devices so there you go we just cleared off all the background apps on both the devices now let's see the network setting so we connected both the devices to the same wi-fi network both are in airplane mode let's clear off the background apps once again so there you go so let's start the speeder so we'll be opening these 16 apps and see how they perform and then we'll come back with the memory management so let's start with asphalt unite so let's see which opens asphalt unite faster So Xiaomi 15 was a tad faster here. So the first game Xiaomi 15 uh, takes the lead. Now BGMI. Let's see which opens BGMI faster. Once again Xiaomi 15 has taken the lead here. And Xiaomi 15 opens it faster. So, so the, both the games Xiaomi 15 takes the lead. Next is uh, Play Store. Uh, or I would say almost same time. Not much of difference. Chrome browser, here I would say Xiaomi 15 once again, Facebook, uh, iQ 13 is faster, Twitter, once again iQ 13 did have a slight advantage, again Xiaomi 15, Spotify, Xiaomi 15 was slightly faster, Amazon, iQ 13 was slightly faster, Flipkart, again iQ was slightly faster, File Manager, almost same time, Settings, iQOO was slightly faster, YouTube, iQOO was slightly faster here, again I, almost same time, camera, probably almost same time, and maps, here again almost same time. So you could see here it's neck to neck in terms of performance except for the games where Xiaomi 15 had a lead other than that almost uh, all the aspects it was neck to neck in terms of performance. So there isn't uh, much of a difference in terms of these two devices in terms of opening of apps because both are Snapdragon 8 Elite uh, powered. Let's see the memory management. So let's go uh, uh, in the reverse order and see uh, if all the apps are available in the memory. So. As of now, it's available. So both the games are available. So you can see here, uh, all the games and all the apps are available in both the devices because both of them have uh, 12 plus gigabyte RAM available. So uh, both the devices did really good in terms of memory management as well. So next let's go to the network uh, speed. Uh, so we have connected both the devices to the same Wi-Fi network and uh, here you can see here we'll just change the server. So both uh, connected to the same server. So let's start with uh, the Xiaomi 15. So it's more or less similar experience there isn't anything to differentiate here. Next, the raw benchmark score. So this is one area where the iQOO 13 takes the lead. You can see here in terms of raw benchmark, this is 23 lakh with the Snapdragon 8 Elite, while this is 27 lakh 
with the Snapdragon 8 Elite. So in terms of raw benchmarks, you can clearly see that the GPU score is uh, higher on the iQOO 13 and that makes uh, with uh, the higher benchmark. So one thing is clear if you are looking for a gaming centric uh, device, probably the iQOO 13 is the clear winner. Not that uh, Xiaomi 15 isn't capable of gaming, but with iQOO, you are uh, getting uh, better thermals as well as better uh, gaming experience. So that is uh, the uh, benchmark score. Let's also see the storage test. Uh, let's see how good the experience you can see here both of UFS 4.0 and 1,63,000 versus 1,75,000 once again IQ has a slight lead here and finally the Geekbench test uh, let's uh, see the results so there you go you can see here 27812910 and the multi-core is 8249 and 8825 so in terms of raw benchmark the IQ 13 is definitely the winner so that was the speed test comparison. So in terms of uh, performance, uh, both are neck to neck. Uh, uh, both have almost similar hardware and performance is also quite similar. The raw benchmark scores, uh, the IQ 13 takes the lead. So that was the speed test comparison of uh, the Xiaomi 15 with uh, the iQOO 13. We'll be having a detailed comparison where we cover uh, the design, display, software experience, camera experience and also the battery life on both the devices. So stay tuned for that and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.